Hi, this is Eric from Motion Workshop. This is the Shadow Mocha Biomechanics Viewer tutorial. To begin, connect to the Shadow Wi-Fi. Now start the Shadow app. And we'll go to the Devices tab. You can see that we're connected and reading from 17 devices. In the 3D Viewer, we're going to set the rest pose. This is the classic T-pose with arms straight out, palms down, feet forward directly underneath your hips. So we'll set the rest pose and now we'll just take a seat. Next go to the settings tab. We need to turn on C3D auto export for export into the C3D format which is compatible with the Mocha Biomechanics viewer. Next go back to the 3D viewer and we're going to record a short take so start recording the take. You can see the icon turns blue, do some arm motion, and stop recording the take. Now on the left you can see it's exported to a C3D file. This will be located along with the, all the rest of the binary take data in the documents folder under motion, take, and then today's date. And here you can see the second take we have in this folder is the C3D file that we're looking for. So next, let's start up Mocha, and we can load that C3D file into this uh, app. Select the C3D file and drag it into the um, Mocha app, and you can see we have it loaded. We'll need to load the shadow skeleton so you can see all the body segments. And then you can just drag the slider and look at the data in the 3D view. You can also plot data, and so we'll just take, for instance, um, take perhaps the right forearm, and we can look at the position data in the top three plots. You can also look at uh, other types of data down under the analog channels. This includes all of the data that's available in the um, SDK data stream, including quaternion data format, Euler angles, uh, and all of the data that you could probably want to look at is in this uh, list here. Some other features in the Mocha app is you can select nodes in the 3D view uh, so that if they're hard to find, it's, you can just click on them inside of the 3D view and they'll get selected. Uh, you can also add motion trails. So if you say track selected marker, uh, it will add a motion trail for that specific one, this, in this case the left hand. So that's it. Uh, Mocha Biomechanics Viewer is a free open source app you can just download and uh, use for viewing shadow motion capture data. Thanks for watching.